off as the third player so that we can have the stream 3DS in the mix. And then um, she will hold her shield in the middle of the stage because when Jigglypuff's shield breaks, it pops and kills her off the top. Um, as soon as the blast zone explosion happens, the game starts. I'm not in the camera view. Ah. Uh, uh, now being joined by my second commentary person, Shai. Shai? Well, yeah. by the second commentary person. Yeah. Let's um, see. Here, scoot over a bit more so you're in the webcam. Yeah. I'm trying to. The webcam for a little bit. There we that go. Might help. Um. I don't know, I haven't seen Sheik play uh, Fox before, so... I've actually yeah. not seen Ninja um, play at all. Ninja Whoa. is Fox with the custom side B that caused an explosion at the end. <laughs> he was talking... Okay. And that's pretty... And Fisk almost killed himself, but did not quite. Managing to recover. Um, it looks like, um, Emphis has a good, uh, percent lead right now. Indeed. Uh, Ninja just doesn't seem to be finding a way in at this point against, well, this Ninja. <laughs> Miss Space is bouncing fish. That could have been an early stock end. But Sheik's one and only solid kill move is the bouncing fish. Yeah. However, it's... Ooh. What? Well, apparently almost back air. But it's yeah, relatively difficult to land. Ah. Ooh. I, I, the problem with that custom side B is that is it, it has a significant it, amount of ending lag. Yeah, as I got to say. And... Emphis <laughs> really liking what he's getting off of these grabs. Like, chain grabbing may have been removed, but he's getting some solid follow-ups that lead right back into a grab. Which I'm pretty sure Sheik can do that with a short uh, hop up air, isn't that now? Uh, until certain percents. Yeah then short hop up air is, I believe, guaranteed. Yeah. If not, it's at least a very solid follow-up. Like, he hasn't moved from 16% since the beginning of this game. Yeah. Like, okay, honestly, right there, as soon as the second thing would have hit, I would have grabbed out a shield there. Yeah. Instead of standing there and waiting a little bit longer. And, wow, this is a really bad match. Um, I believe that Ninja was holding away... Oh. Because the red lightning effect did not happen, and that generally shows that you would have died without any VI. For those of you who don't know, VI vectoring, or whatever you want to call it, is the replacement for directional influence, DI, from the earlier Smash games, where you could change the angle that you were being launched slightly. In this, you can actually change, like, you can hold against where you're being hit and fly less far, or you can also hold the direction you're being hit and end up dying from it which I believe is what happened to Ninja's Fox there. But at this point, Ninja still has not, not managed to land hit. another hit. Which is very... Emphis is just worrisome. tearing him apart with these grab combos. And He didn't Ninja, punish that. I think that at this point, Ninja is honestly kind of scared to go in and punish because every time he's tried, it's Punny. not working so well. But he needs to do so. He just needs to be faster about it or space it better, not yeah. just opt to not punishing it. Honestly, I'd rather be punished for not punishing correctly than not to punish at all. Yeah, because one, you at least have a chance of getting something yeah. better. This fly's been bothering me. Yep. <laughs> oh, he got a hit in! Wow. And it just... I don't know. It's, it's more of what... Uh, how? Oh! Wow. I mean, that's probably not going to matter too much. It just stops the whole uh, three stock. It'd yeah. still be a JB three stock, though. That. Which. That was, I did not expect him to do that. Because I'm pretty sure he could have easily recovered, but I guess just Circle Pad Y. Yeah. The motto of Smash 4 3DS. Yeah. Well, it doesn't look like he hits his JB. But he does get the game. Alright, and with that, M. Fisk, who I totally forgot to unblue in the name section, takes game one. Which one? Yeah, um, that side B for Fox, just, it's not strong enough to make up for its ending lag. Oh, Thomas got it, okay. Cool, I don't have to get up. <laughs> oh, my back hurts. Oh, jeez. Um, me and Jax are going to be playing after this. Indeed. 
As soon as this match is over, we will be swapping out. Mfisk and I assume Ninja will be commentating in here as we fight. I've learned my worst character against you, finally. It's my King DDD. <laughs> I'm back. Hang on, just a second. Um, Who is he, playing? I will be right back. Alright. Alright, so we're going on to game two. And it looks like Ninja has changed to Gren Ninja. Ninja Ashin. I, I'm gonna call him Ninja. I don't. I don't get the whole Ashin part of his name. And we're at Arena Ferox. Um, the only downside about, about the whole Jigglypuff killing herself thing at this point is the whole um, stage changing in the middle of the game. <laughs> Go! Alright. And it looks like... I don't know, so far they really haven't done much. And gets caught into a jab combo. Gets grabbed and... Whoa, down air, interesting. Grab to down air, that was interesting. Almost died because of the thing carrying him off. Oh my god. Ninjas just can't get a hit in. Yeah, there we go. God, so many times I see Ninja could have punished. the reason why he's not doing really well right now. Bounce. Ooh. The thing is, he's not getting a lot of punishes in, and he's getting punished a lot. It's his biggest problem right now. And down <laughs> At least he's getting a little bit more hits in than he had last time. See, that was a good grab punish right there. Stage change is so weird with the smoke at the bottom. It can confuse players, I think, a little bit. Hits him with that up air. He just repeatedly up aired and finally hit uh, Master Fist with it. He was below Master Fist and he kept up airing and Master Fist kept avoiding it, but then he got hit by it because he kept doing it. All right. Uh, Ooh, hit back. with the Shadow Sneak. Oh, if he wouldn't have dashed attack instead of what it grabbed, it would have been a good punish. Right now, though, Ninja has been surviving a pretty long time, so I don't think he's been doing whole- He's doing a lot better than his first match. So right. far. So from what I've seen, I mean, he's punished a few more times than he did- He's punished more than he did in the first match. And he's still alive, wow. She has such a tough time killing. Indeed, it- Uh... Bouncing Fish, that's the name of it, is her only really good kill move. I mean, back air can kill, but it's hard to land back air. Well, back air, it's not so much that, it's that killing- with it, they have to be at very high percent. Like 188, yeah, it'll kill. But, hey. Alright. Back to the match at hand that you're finally back. Yeah, um, I'm actually going to tag out Tom. Would you mind commentating? Alright, I need to go get Brawl pairing set up. Alright. And hit with the fourth match. This is Jaxa signing off. Alright, have Thomas commentating with me now. Well, hello, this is Tomcat. Alright, um, right now, ooh, that was a nice, uh, counter. It's not really a counter, though, but, you know. Yeah. His, uh, custom down B. Why didn't... He could have easily grabbed Punish. Yeah, right I know, I, I see. Is that He's just missing a lot of his chances. So far, it's, that's his problem. He's missing all of his the chances he can Not get. even that. Master Fist missed his chance to grab Punish yeah. that uh, down B. Yeah. Which... Oh, that was a good stock. Go. Ninja is not doing terrible this game. At he least. is. He's, uh, he's only 36, but it's not too big. Really, uh, Ooh, nice. 
Because he rolled into that. Yeah. Okay, forward smash. And... Oh, circle pad. Yep. <laughs> circle pad? Why? <laughs> yeah, I think he meant to up B it. I hate when it does that. When it, You mean to up B and it side beats like that. Yeah. Especially with Greninja, because you can't recover out of it very easily. It has so much ending lag. The disrespect. The taunt? Yeah. I don't like taunting. I don't taunt. I don't have, like, brawl, I don't have taunts. So In I this game, I you can't turn off taunts, so. Yeah. But I'll still just do random. Uh, things, but going back to Ninja. Yeah. So far, uh... Ninja doesn't look like he's in a good position. He, no, he is not. They're essentially at the same percentage, but Ninja's dead. But look, his stock lower, and the stock does matter. Yes, a lot. Especially since he SD'd that stock. Yeah. And Master Fisk is just trying to hog that ledge. Or yeah. was. That up air on Sheik is really good. It builds up percent pretty quickly. Oh, okay, good. I was about to say, if he would have side beat again, that would have just. Yeah. That would have been the worst way to lose this game. And it doesn't look like he's gonna win, but. Oh, yeah, those statues are breakable, like in Castle Seed. <laughs> yep. That bouncing fish does a lot of damage. It does. And, like like AJ was saying, it's, it's only it was it's only Sheik's only reliable kill move. Yeah. So far, this match seems to be nearly. I don't know. Because Ninja has a pretty high percent, but if Ninja can get an early kill... If he can get at least, uh, can stop, uh, Sheik from recovering, that should do good. That should be good for him. This, this fly is being really annoying. And Hits the bouncing fish. Just, oh, and okay. circle pad. Circle pad, why? <laughs> okay, well, Master Friends win game two. And so, um, me and AJ are up next, actually, after his, uh, brawl match. Uh. So, who am I facing?